Welcome to Vinny's. Vinny's. Vinny's, 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 Vinny's talk, man. And welcome back, man. It's Monday, then live and direct, man, from your boy Vinny. Um, how's everybody doing? Anyway, it's Monday. What do you want from me? It's Vinny D, man. Snow on the ground. Um, the weather hasn't been the greatest. About 30 degrees. Uh, a low about 4 haven't had much time to really go hiking or uh, do much of anything outside wise uh, besides all the snow. Luckily this year we haven't had too much snow guys, um, but welcome. Make sure you guys like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. We have a lot of cool things on my YouTube channel from all my tributes, all my on the go podcasts, all my uh, nature stuff, a couple of my movies, uh, tribute to my grandpa, tribute to the Gabs. Um, Tribute to all my cool drone videos. Got a lot of cool new stuff coming up in nature. And this year, I want to do more uh, podcasts on the go when I'm doing hiking and uh, stuff of that sort. So anyways, guys, welcome to my podcast. And uh, how's everybody doing, man? It's uh, fucking Monday. What are you guys doing at home? Besides nothing, got to get outside your comfort zone and uh, do something you would normally do. Anyways, there's a few things I want to talk about today. Um... Everybody's talking about the mask policies and how they're loosening, loosening, loosening restrictions, which is a good thing with uh, everything that's going on in the world. Hopefully we could come to some s sort of agreement where we could kind of get out there and uh, be ourselves again, um, you know, and not have to worry about so much of this uh, COVID, COVIDio situation. We're like, Vinny, what's, what's the Covodio situation? Well, the Covodio situation is just COVID-related stuff, and we don't want to spread anything that's uh, misnews or something that's mishap or something. I don't want to say so. I would tell you guys to go talk to your doctor and get the best medical advice and talk to your doctor. Um, today, I'm rocking the Tucson, Arizona, Valley of the Sun. Man, I miss Arizona. It's a, it's, it's, it was a good time that I had there. It was a very, very warm well, the time that I went wasn't um, wasn't as warm. It was probably about 65, close to 70 during the day. But I went right before Christmas, so it was pretty fucking splendid. Let me tell you that. Um, but yeah, man, I've just been chilling. Uh, got, went to the dentist today. The dentist! Got my teeth clean. I haven't been to the dentist in a while, so we went to the dentist today. Got my teeth clean. Feel good, feel good. Um, and, uh, we're in the middle of fucking winter. We're almost, uh, halfway done with winter. Getting ready for, uh, spring and summer. I can't wait for spring and summer, man, of 2022. T-Gold Blue. You know what I mean? Anyways, man, a lot of exciting new things coming up. Podcasts and, you know, cool hiking places that I want to do more, uh, recording. Um, a few places that I didn't really get to go to last summer on my bike. I want to try to do it this year and uh, maybe get out to Lake Geneva and uh, do some more uh, state park. Um, just get on the scenery and, uh, you know, try to try to get more cool pics and videos that way. And hey, who knows, maybe we'll do it on the podcast on the fly and upload it to the channel. But uh, yeah, man, today has been a cool day. Just uh, kind of cold outside. Haven't really been able to you know go out and do too much but um hasn't been too bad i'd say like in the 30s you know what i mean i can't wait till it's 60 to 70 degrees uh but like i said i want to talk about a few things and we today we want i wanted to talk a little bit about um with everything going on in the world and what it is to deal with like, anxiety um and mental health and how how people effectively deal with that kind of thing you know when I was uh <clears throat> when I was in high school I, I never really had a filter but I don't have a filter now but I, I didn't really have no one really to talk to I mean I had friends I've always hung out with a lot of people and a lot of friends but um you know being a, someone who dealt with 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 the whole mental aspect of having the anxiety and then trying to use medicine as a as a remedy medicine can only do so much right so there's things that I would tell people and I would, I would, I would uh, recommend like, you know, getting out and doing things more and having more hobbies. Uh, see, the thing is what I used to do was 
when I was in high school, I used to read a lot, like read books. I, I don't read as much as I should now, but, um, you know, I, I, we used to play football all the time with, with my buddies, get out there, get out in the dirt. When's, when's the last time you've seen kids playing the dirt, man? Playing the, uh, just anything, you know, people don't really, really mingle with each other anymore. I mean, yeah, they do sometimes, but I mean, it's not like it used to be back in my days, you know, back in like, you know, 1999 and fucking when I was in high school. I mean, I graduated in 04. You know, we 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 did things a lot different than the kids do now, you know, the now these days. But I've always had that mindset where I like to do the, like, hobby set, you know, playing sports and just being outside. And um, But for the mental, the mental side of it, like, uh, um, for the anxiety, I don't know, I've always... Just try to really read a lot, um, listen to music, because uh, you know the last couple of years for everyone has been tough. You know, dealing with all this shit. Um, I mean, honestly, I've had COVID, and my experience with COVID was, I mean, not the greatest. You know, uh, sucks dealing with any type of sickness. But um, as far as you know, having it and then finally getting it and then getting over it. You know, I was happy that I finally got in and got over it. But I mean, I, I don't worry about it anymore. I'm I'm done really talking about it. I think that the media and uh, the more they talk about it, the more we hear about it, the more people just stress about it. And then it just becomes me even more of an issue. So I think if, if people would, wouldn't talk about the issues as much and, you know, granted, God bless and, you know, prayers for all the people that have lost loved ones to this, as well as myself. I, I know what it's like to lose one to uh, COVID and stuff like that. But I just feel like, um, I mean, the more less we talk about it, the more positive and we can get past it. Because honestly, I'm done with it. I'm here. I'm like a sphere. It's a sunny day. No, it's it's dark now, but it was a nice, there was some sun out today and it was beautiful. A little cold, but like I said, man, the more, the less we talk about it you know, the more we will be better off. We got to look uh, deeper in the future and, you know, keep the horizon good. It's your boy Vinny D, man. You guys are tuned in to Vinny's Talk. A lot of exciting podcasts coming up live here on the YouTube. Um, I'm going to be doing more podcasts, man. Not as many as I would like to do or talk about or whatever, but um, I tried to jump on and let my... Uh, feelings be heard and, and and tell you guys how i'm doing what's up and just uh update you know what i'm saying and just talk for a few minutes uh some things that i'm in the works with is um just uh i think we might do a little something for the anniversary it was at the 110th anniversary coming up in april we're probably gonna do a special broadcast uh titanic anniversary of the sinking talk a little bit about that and in march uh, dropping that Gabby Petito um, uh, Celebration of Life podcast. I want to do that and been working on that. So uh, I'm going to be dropping that in March. And then we got spring and summer, you know what I mean? So I'm probably going to be doing a lot on the fly podcast, just, you know, doing some rides and going to some cool, like, state parks. And who knows, man, probably going to drop some cool shit there, you know, do some recordings and edits and uh, do some reviews on some new forests areas and i don't know I, that's what i like to do i like to be out there and just you know hitting up some cool spots and uh just seeing what's up man and living my life but yeah man it's just been chilling like a mother villain um today was was it was a decent day like i said man i went to the dentist um i was talking to the to my dentist and he told me that uh, do you do any snowboarding or, or, or skiing, you know? I said, you know what I mean? Like, I like to uh, I like to snowboard, more of a surfer, you know what I mean? Like, you know, surfing on the waves and shit. But I miss I miss spring and summer, man. I mean, don't get me wrong, guys. I like, I like snow, but I can only take so much of this shit. Like, I can only take so much of the snow and, and, and you know, being out there in the cold. Granted, I do love flying my drone and getting some cool shots over the water when the lake is frozen. Everybody says, why don't you uh, walk on the lake when it's frozen? We, we did a lot of cool, like I did a lot of cool podcasts. The, was it last year or two years before that? We did like some on the fly stuff, which was pretty cool. 
Um, I didn't get a chance to get out there this year, but hopefully, you know, we can get a chance out to Mallard, you know, maybe do a little podcast out there and see how that goes. But, um, yeah, man, I can't believe that, you know, this, this year is coming up in April. It'll be you know, 110 years anniversary since the Titanic will be underneath the great cold, cold Atlantic Ocean. I was reading articles that, um, you know, in the next 30 years, we, we do not know if she will be in her great glory, you know, together underneath there because the, the ocean salts are just, you know, eating at her. Um, it's an amazing story, man, about the ship and the amazing people aboard the ship and what the, what the ship, you know, stood for. A lot of people probably don't really understand what the Titanic stood for. And, um, you know, there was a lot of people that came over from other countries to come to America, the United States of America, um, to make a living. Um, you know, this all stems back from, you know, centuries and centuries. But, um, you know, a lot of people were dealing with sadness and, you know, job loss and, you know, maybe price that people didn't have enough money so they wanted to come to america to make a better you know like my ancestors my italian ancestors did but like i said man it all it all stems back to like who we are as people and how we overcome things um you know in the mental health and anxiety that's why i said having a hobby and getting out of your comfort zone and doing things to make you happy is, is a big thing but i don't know i just like to uh talk about stuff like that because i think it's interesting you know what i mean but what do you want from me man i just hop on here for a few minutes and talk and whatever we just bullshit and whatever comes out of it comes out of it you know what i mean i don't try to uh i mean i'm not trying to impress nobody i just come on here it's a stress reliever and if i can make someone's day then so be it man you know i try to i try to do my best you know what i mean so Anyways, guys, I want to thank you guys for joining all my my, my, my videos and uh, tuning in my podcast. Um, but just thinking about the years and years um, that the Titanic, right? We all think about that. How many years it's uh, been been there in the water, and then think about you physically being here in the in the world and um, how how precious life is and God's gift gives us this beautiful life you know what i mean gives us this beautiful life and how we should be uh passionate and uh just happy you know we're happy human beings and we have to strive so thank you guys man you guys can give it a like dislike either way it's a reaction interaction and uh thank you guys for joining the podcast today um finney's talk man we uh we do this it's just, like i said it's a stress reliever um, the winter time, the summertime, um, anybody could do a podcast. Uh, a lot of people are faced with the reality of maybe they're scared to, hmm, how do I say this? Like not a lot of people like to talk about their feelings or don't want to be on the camera or, um, I used to, I used to be the type of person where I didn't really want to talk too much about like anything or don't want to talk to maybe like a social worker or talk about my problems or, you know, my anxiety. But when I got it out, um, you know, it was definitely something that made me feel better. And, uh, you know, when I do these podcasts or just talking in general, it's just, it's just, it's just good for you, man. It's good for the psyche. The psyche gets better. You feel better about yourself. That's why I said it's good for you. But yeah, man, thank you guys for joining the podcast today. Make sure you put a battery tender on your motorcycle if you got one. Keep her nice and warm. Thank you guys for joining, man. Vinny's Talk.